I'd like to teach the world to sing in perfect harmony, grow apple trees and honeybees and snow white turtle doves. And I've been trying to do that my whole life. I started singing very young in church. Oh, about three or four I sang my first solos. Then I started traveling with a youth choir, did musicals and plays, and had a great time. My mentor, Gilbert Davis, taught me to sing from my heart, taught me to sing for my soul, and taught me how to share that with everyone. When I became a teacher, that was my job. I had to listen to my students, try to understand them, and grow to love each one of them. I have one memory of a couple of children who couldn't talk, and they learned to sing. They could make sounds, and I taught them how to match pitch and sing. Some children don't know our language. They come to this foreign country and they think, oh, I'm scared. Again, I find these things out. I listen to my kids and I sing some songs in their language and they begin to sing. I have been in Greeley for hmm, almost 49 years. And during that time, I raised my two children, Cohen and Emily, taught music in schools the whole time. I, I loved working in the church and doing things there. All of those things were very important to me and my love of music grew and grew. Being here for so long, I got to be involved in a lot of other things. I am a member of the Chorale for over 30 years now and that's brought opportunities all over the world. I remember singing in Rome and it was amazing to go into this cathedral and here we are singing Mozart's Requiem with a little Mozart orchestra. But one of the most important things to me is the creation of the Greeley Children's Chorale. My best friends, Kay Copley Boyd, Pam Korth, and Cheryl McBride also helped in this endeavor. It's always good to look out to the audience and see the joy that the children bring to them. Another great event with the Greeley Chorale and the Children's Chorale was the fifth anniversary of the Oklahoma City bombing. And we sang the Dean Rischel Requiem for the Children, very sobering requiem. And it was intermingled with children's songs. And I'm still touched by that today, all these years later. Amazing the things that music brings to your life. It's better to see the world through song and similar eyes, many cultures and many languages, the joy in humanity. I will continue to teach the world to sing.